Welcome to NJCTL. My name is John Ennis. I'm a faculty member at NJCTL, and I'm here to talk to you about algebra-based physics. Algebra-based physics is kind of the fundamental science you need to start on a science career in high school. It serves as a foundation. For example, chemistry is all about molecules and atoms interacting, while physics tells you why they do that and how they do that. Biology, again, it's all about molecules again, except really big ones like DNA. And the physics is still the same. So you get a good solid foundation in physics when you do take biology, it makes more sense and it's more interesting. It's math-based, that's in the title, algebra-based physics. A lot of people are scared of algebra. They're scared of math. If you're taking the algebra-based physics course, you now see what algebra is used for. And then if you also have the algebra itself, you now do better in that, and that also helps you do better in physics. Candidates for this course are teachers. Anybody who has an interest in teaching science, this will help prepare you one, to get a teaching certificate so you can actually teach it at a school, or if you're just interested in it because it's kind of fun. The resources we have to support you are all online. We have presentations that are recorded. You can listen to somebody talking about the physics. We have problem sets that you can work. We also tell you how to solve the problem sets and in great detail, so that should be very helpful. To help you with all of this, we have obviously the materials online, which you can use at your pace at any time. And we have faculty to help you with any of your questions or requests.